The blower motor housing and filters are located under the cowl cover piece at the base of the windshield and indicated by the red arrow. Begin by pulling up and removing the rubber seal that runs along the divider between the engine bay and the HVAC system, red arrow. You will need to remove the plastic cover, red arrow. There is a very good chance this will not come off in one piece. These get very old and brittle over the years. If you have not removed it lately, there is a good chance you will damage it and need to replace it when removing. With the cover off, you will see the blower motor housing, red arrow, that has a metal filter on each end, yellow arrows. The filters, which are just metal screens, clip onto the ends of the housing, red arrow, one shown. Unclip the screen and maneuver it out, red arrow. A lot of people like to make their own filters for the airbox screen. Some people just place a dryer sheet between the screen and the housing, while other people cut furnace filters down to size. If you are going to install your own filter, I recommend spraying the outside of the screen with some matte tack or glue and adhering the filter of choice to the outside. This way it cannot get sucked into the fans. If you ever want to return the screen to its original condition, just scrape the homemade filter, sand, paint the metal screens and you're done. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and check out another video in this series.